16 year old from St. Louis Park is about to become one of the University of Minnesota's youngest graduates. Coming up next month, he'll complete a bachelor's degree and is already accepted into grad school. Leah Bino caught up with the teenager between classes as he reflects back and looks forward to his future plans. Sometimes there's sort of a wow period for maybe a week or two, but then everyone just sort of gets used to seeing me in class and it just becomes a sort of normal occurrence. As a fourth year physics major with a math minor, 13 year old Elliot Tanner remains one of the youngest students at the University of Minnesota. What do you want to be when you grow up? I hope to become a professor here at UMIN. Specifically, Elliot wants to be a high energy theoretical physicist and ultimately a professor of physics here at the U. Get him talking about his latest research project and it seems He's on his way. We've also been working with Fermilab on the short, on the short baseline neutrino program. I don't understand any I of that. Did you understand no. all that? <laughs> no, no. Elliot's mom, Michelle, says he started reading and doing math by age three. A few years later, he needed challenges beyond her homeschooling. He tore through high school curriculum when he was seven and eight and started college at age nine. People who hear Elliot's story is, is that he doesn't get to be a kid or he grew up too fast. And um, he still very much is a kid. And the only difference is, is he goes to school at a different building. Looking toward the future, Elliot has been accepted into the U's physics PhD program, but now he's trying to figure out how to pay for it. We're just kind of been exploring all our options and coming up with dead ends, trying to apply to any scholarships or grants, fellowships, and um, we have not been successful. The Tanners are trying a GoFundMe fundraiser to help pay for Elliot's graduate school tuition. But in the meantime, like any student on the verge of graduating, he's proud and excited for his next chapter. Incredibly, it's just been an amazing roller coaster. Leah Bino, Fox 9. <laughs> wow, just you know, wow. Congratulations to him. You know, getting through a physics program at the U <laughs> is hard <laughs> enough. Um, most people struggle with basic arithmetic yeah. and look at the advanced level that he's achieving at. I had the pleasure of meeting him two years ago mm -hmm. when he graduated from Normandale Community College and I mean look at what he's done in two years it's amazing. That's and you could person. tell then. Right yeah absolutely very special young man and then you know to see his advancement I can't wait to see where he's at two years from now really. Stay tuned. He'll be a professor before we know it right? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh my goodness.